Hey, YouTube. It's right here. Smoking. Esotericus Ramsgate. Now, this is a Virginia aromatic. It's definitely not, not the kind of aromatic, especially that um, we Americans are used to. Definitely not. This is this is very different. Uh, much like Blackpool, it's a very, um, it's just a Virginia blend with a licorice topping. Now, the licorice topping on it is, um, it's more of a licorice liqueur type of um, taste. And you can definitely taste it throughout the smoke. And every now and then, when you wait a little bit between, between drags, you get this really, really intense... Um, liqueur taste, licorice liqueur taste, which is amazing. Very nice fermentation process in it. Now, the tobacco itself, let me put this down for a little bit. Um, when, I, when I first opened the bag, it, um, I was kind of worried. By the way, the smell that you get. Unfreaking real. I mean, this smells like there's just nothing but liqueur in here. It's almost like you open up a bottle of really mellow, nice, sweet wine. Not that alcoholic -y stuff you buy at the store. <laughs> but like a really nice, very nice uh, aged wine. Now, the tobacco, see if you guys can see a little bit of it. I don't know if you'll be able to tell, but yeah, you can tell. See how wide it is? That right there, um, at first, I wasn't sure if it was just like sugar crystals or if it was um, what do you call it? Um, if you know, if they had uh, that moss <laughs> thing that you know. Uh, some people have been complaining about that they find in their tobaccos. I wasn't sure what it was, but, um, you know, I was like, well, if it's not <laughs> just the sugar buildup or, or from the topping or anything like that, if it really is that the tobacco is got that moss or something or whatever you call it, you know, I think, well, you know, you're going to burn it anyway. So <laughs> is it really that bad? smoke tobacco that's you know has that <laughs> i don't know at any rate uh back to this so as you can as you saw it's it's very it's got that you know white um you know i guess it's crystallized you know sugar on top and you know it makes the tobacco look almost grayish um but like i said before this is one of those tobaccos that unbelievably so it tastes just like it smells right out of the bag it's just amazing it's it's very mellow it's um rich full um you know and and, it, and i gotta be honest it's not complex in the least bit there's not you don't get all these notes of you know sweetness here and bitterness here and and maybe a little little hints of cocoa here or anything like that or nutty or anything. No, no, you don't. This is straightforward, a Virginia blend with a licorice topping, and that licorice topping is amazing. 
uh, like I said, it's more of a licorice liqueur. Uh, so it's basically like if you were smoking tobacco dipped in licorice liqueur and then left fermented uh, for a long time um, like that, and that's what you taste. It is, uh, it's just a very mellow, amazingly mellow, like I said, rich, full, uh, smooth smoke. I can't say enough about this blend. Um, you know, I had tried Blackpool, and after I did my review on Blackpool, a lot of you guys uh, suggested Ramsgate. Um, so I want to thank you all who did, uh, for all, all you guys that um, suggested Ramsgate, and everybody said the same thing. You know, if you like Blackpool, you're going to love Ramsgate, and you guys were right. Uh, Ramsgate is definitely better than Blackpool. It's just a lot more sweeter. Uh, has a little bit more flavor, although nothing nothing bad to say about Black Hole, because Black Hole is an amazing blend, but Ramsgate just, is just a little bit better if you are looking for that, you know, particular taste, just a little bit more enhanced, definitely Ramsgate. All right, compadres, comadres, as always, thank you for watching. Sorry, I'm already going over five minutes, but um, yeah, wow, I mean, I could really do a, you know, 30-minute review on this tobacco. I mean, just keep going on and on. What an amazing blend. Definitely um, definitely changing my mind on the Esoterica line, which, you know, I didn't think too much of before. All right, comadres, comadres, as always, thank you for watching. Y vayan con Dios.